Here he is. Oh. Oh. <laughs> hey Plastics und willkommen zu unserem neuen Video. And if you don't speak German, welcome to Plastic Chat, where we talk about toys, dolls, collectibles, and today, today. the Na 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 Surprise Team. So if you follow my channel, we've already opened the Coco Von Sparkle, and today I have... <laughs> Quinn Nash. Shark. Baby shark. Baby shark. Do 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 do. Baby shark. Do 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 do. Baby shark. Do 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 do. Baby shark. We have the first boy. Na 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 teens. The only one in this series so far. Yeah, I mean, there's only five. Here is his packaging. <laughs> It's also in pink, so I have to complain a little bit. I oh. think it would be nicer if all the packages would fit the colors of their outfit and not all of them are pink, but I am a picky Ooh. Oh, I kind of like the packaging. It's not really pink. It's kind of like this wineish color and then it changes color. Look at that. Look closely. You have hearts, paw prints, cat heads, all this cute stuff. So it's kind of like luxurious couch. Let's check out the back. It says taking a big bite out of life. <laughs> oh god. Welcome to the lifestyles of the plush and grammarist. We've got a soft spot for- oh yeah, it's, it's, it's the same. It's the same thing. Okay, I'm not even gonna bother reading that. Let's open him up. Yes. These are like already half open. They're so easy. And... Front row. Oh my god, you scared me. Wow. I thought that was an earthquake. <laughs> <laughs> Drum roll. <laughs> Ugh. I still don't really like this packaging. Here he is. Gosh, this this is like dangerous plastic still. Feel that. Oh yeah. So in the last video I said I like it more, but probably we're just lucky opening it up because this is still sharp plastic, so No, I mean I think they they weakened it around the seam, but yeah. Here he is. Oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Usually we complain that stuff is fixed too well. Now a little bit of plastic. <laughs> what about? Oh. <laughs> well, let's look at the doll first, obviously. There, okay. There, there he is. <laughs> he has like a, what do you call it? A hairnet? Yeah. On. Huh. That's interesting. So he's totally different from the girls in that respect because he's not fixed in the package whatsoever. Yeah. There are ties, but... Um... Obviously they didn't work as you just saw on camera. <laughs> <laughs> Jawsome awesome. underwear. I mean, the back is just hilarious. He has a smiley shark on his butt. <laughs> <laughs> and then he has like a shark tooth necklace. He has a little band-aid on his knees, so he's a bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> and he also has sharky socks. Cute. I love those. Rachel would love this doll. Where is Rachel? Rachel? Aw, Rachel. She loves sharks. She's obsessed with sharks. I think she would have loved this one. Let's do the surprises first and then look at the doll. I'm dressing. This time he's gonna start. I mean, I already know what it is. That's why. Yeah. So first one, which is... Whoa. Ah, another brush. <laughs> another brush. <laughs> but it has a little sharky. I mean, functional, whatever, brush. It's not like he has 300 others. Which I think are his shoes. And we all know MJ's makes great shoes. Oh, yeah. Ooh, yes. Oh, those sneakers. Here we go. Oh my god, I want a pair of those. Like always for MGA, I also want those, so there are little waves on the side. Really, really nice sneakers. I mean, this is something you don't even see at Barbie anymore, like painted shoes. Like for our River Candle video, I really want those shoes as well. Like you were saying, this is where I think they should have done different. They should have made the surprise packets different color. Because gold doesn't go with, with him. I mean, actually, let, let's be real, they should probably be paper and not plastic. That is a good point. I mean, they already figured it out with the LOL surprise. Why is this one not in the same recyclable package that they came up with? Mm. Well, maybe for series two, fingers crossed. Yeah, I mean, overall, the whole Nana Na series, less plastic, please. All right. So we have 
his little oh shorts. They're not that little. He gets a little swim trunk. Let's say na 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 all over them and different fonts, different letterings. They really did a lot of specialized calligraphy for this. I really appreciate the turquoise trim along the bottom. So that is really good. Next surprise. Oh, here we go. We have his little t-shirt with a shark on it. It says Amity Island Surf Club. Okay. <laughs> I mean, do you know what that reference is? I have no idea. Explain. It's Jaws. Oh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you can't tell <laughs> by the sharks. I mean, I could tell that it has something to do with sharks, but... <laughs> oh. He has a PhD. In biology, not in movie theory <laughs> or movie history. It has a little shark on it. It's in black. It opens all the way on the back. So it will be really easy to dress him. Like for the oh, yeah. first one that we opened, it also comes with the premium. Yeah, premium, very thick, very sturdy, very embroidered. I give that to you for quality control as always. It's fine. It's done in the doll clothes manner. All right. Next one. Get more and more confusing on how to open. Okay, guys. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love this. A hoodie. Oh, wow. This is the first real hoodie I see for any MGA doll, I think. Wow. It's a gray hoodie with a zipper. The hood has shark teeth. <laughs> I mean, it's a little bit flimsily made, I'm not gonna lie. They didn't press their seams, unpress seams. This trim is not, it's sticking up as you can see. So that needs a nice iron so it lies flat. I will say I love, love, love this design. And I really like, appreciate that it is an actual hoodie and not like the fake hoodies that we've seen before for the but rainbow highs. Important question. Will it fit over the head? Absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you never know. I mean, you know. You know. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, let's open up the last surprise. What can that be? It is, of course, his hat. Ooh. This is a very interesting material. I didn't expect that. Does anybody still wear a hat? Does anyone still wear a hat? Seems to be fake leather. Oh. It's vegan leather. Vegan leather. Okay, <laughs> it's plastic leather. <laughs> vegan leather. And here it says the same thing as on the box, I think. Jawsome. Yes. With the it's little shark fin. Here we go. It's embroidered. It's embroidered. Oh, I just see it has actually a little metal clip here at the back to oh. adjust. Oh, yes. The... Oh, I mean, it doesn't actually adjust. It just moves. It's well, I mean, that's a nice little detail. It slides. I don't know if you guys can see. It slides along the band. But with always be very, very careful with doll clothes and pleather because pleather has a tendency to rip very easily if it's not finished in any way. And I've seen that happen before where little tabs like that just rip right off so easily. Be very careful, guys. I mean, we already know his name, Quinn Nash. His birthday is September 3rd. And, and of course, his catchphrase, taking a big bite out of life. Now I wonder, is his birthday the day Jaw actually came to the movie theaters? We're gonna look that up. <laughs> Somewhere around here. Yeah, I mean, okay, you guys no. already saw the doll, so let's put him in his clothes. Oh. Or do we want to look at his <gasps> hair? Oh, we didn't even look at the hair. Yeah, it's let's do this so up. soft. Ooh, this is very floofy, like a teddy bear. And from his hairstyle, I get extreme river panda vibes because it's the same kind of like hairstyle that he has. The doll being made out of fabric really lends itself to this style because instead of doing flocking like they did for River Kendall or like they usually do for boys, they actually use a plush material on there. If you look in the back, you can see the seam line. So it's actually like plush fabric. Ooh. 
I can I tell that. you it is super, super soft. Yeah, so. it feels, oh my God, I could like feel that forever. It feels like one of these Christmas socks that are really plushy and you just want to wear them all <laughs> the time. That's how it feels. You have a few of those, right? Yeah. Let's do articulation check. Arms, legs, head, and wire. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. So he is also fully poseable with all the wires in his legs and arms. Yeah. Except the wire on the leg isn't as... Ooh, okay, that looks a bit funny. <laughs> <laughs> he just broke his leg surfing. I mean, that's what the band aids there for. Here he is, all dressed up. The shoes, his shorts, the t-shirt, the hoodie, and this time the hat is actually fitting. I really appreciate that. What do you think about his face? Let's get this. Take the hat off for a second again. Yeah, I actually, I actually appreciate him without the hat, to be honest. Yeah, same, because he has gorgeous hair. I love this like glacial blue hair and his face up, it's just, I mean, it's very simple. It's very cute, nice little straight eyebrows. I'm still not a fan of this sweater. That's like the edge of, I don't know if you guys can see, but this edge is keep just rolls up. So you see all that raw edge right there. The clothes could have needed some ironing, I think, to stay flat. Overall, I really like him. He's super cute. I'm surprised. I didn't really think I was going to like him, to be honest. And he definitely looks better than the normal small na 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 boys, especially because he has this hair and not the, like, the, hat. the hat that oftentimes doesn't look that great on the boy dolls that they have for the na 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 so far in my opinion and i still really like the uh, the penguin the penguin one yeah he was super cute i think still my favorite for 30 dollars i mean it's a nice decent doll gotta say and this time except for the non-iron hoodie i think there were no quality control issues with him right no actually oh my god i didn't even notice the little zipper pull on the bottom of his sweater right there that's a cute little detail he's pretty cute pretty great oh wait that's a little bit weird his lips he has like pouty lips or something oh well, actually it doesn't it's only from the side actually yeah, yeah. never mind quality control wise can't complain looks pretty fine besides like the very normal things that you would expect from a mass-produced doll like unpressed scenes pretty good he is a great fashion doll i think for 30 dollars i mean so far these not not teens i'm really loving obsessed with uh, yeah, I keep touching it. Yeah, that was our review. Tell us what you think. Did you guys like him? Will you guys get him? I think he's worth checking out. There will be more Na 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 teens. So if you want to see these videos, subscribe to his channel, hit the notification button, and don't forget to check out our other videos on Na 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 surprises. With that said, keep, keep it plastic. plastic.